Difference between iloop.current.run underscore and underscore executor and threadpool executor dot submit. I'm quite new to Python Tornado and have been trying to start a new thread to run some IO blocking code whilst allowing the server to continue to handle new requests. I've been doing some reading but still can't seem to figure out what the difference is between these two functions. For example calling a method like this. Compared to. Write underscore gresp underscore workbook takes some information from the object report and writes it to an Excel spreadsheet. However, I'm using OpenPixel which takes tilde 20s to load an appropriately formatted workbook and another tilde 20s to save it which stops the server from handling new requests. The function simply returns true or false, which is what my underscore success is, as the report object has the path of the output file attached to it. I haven't quite gotten either of these methods to work yet so they might be incorrect but was just looking for some background information. Cheers! iloop.run underscore in underscore executor and executor dot submit do essentially the same thing but return different types iloop.run underscore in underscore executor returns an asyncio dot future while executor dot submit returns a concurrent dot futures dot future the two future types have nearly identical interfaces with one important difference only asyncio dot future can be used with a wait in a coroutine the purpose of run underscore in underscore executor is to provide this conversion If you want to support the channel, please consider liking and subscribing.